morning, uh, my name is Melvin Nike. I'm the executive mayor of George and uh, we're here this morning at the Salinas uh, restaurant in Wilderness where we have just hosting, uh, hosted the, uh, the raising of the blue flag um, for the Wilderness Beach. Uh, I'm very excited about what is happening, uh, what has happened here today. Uh, this is a pilot that we um, are raising of the blue flag here and I'm very excited about what, what is happening, especially as far as tourism is concerned. Um, we are in the festive season now. Um, this area attracts quite a lot of uh, tourists here and uh, having a blue flag, although it is pilot at this stage, um, status here in wilderness means a lot for us as the city and for the region as a whole. Uh, especially for me, what stands out um, about this, this uh, blue flag raising here is the criteria um, about safety and services that is, that is available here in this area. Um, so um, this for me is a, is, a, is a pointer in the right direction because people, um, they welcome here. People know, especially as far as children is concerned, it is safe here. We have the necessary resources should uh, anything happen, an accident or something, there is services available like emergency services, um, the lifeguards are on duty, um, ambulance services, helicopter is available. We have the necessary uh, ablution facilities also here. Um, our water quality is good here. Um, so I'm very proud of what has happened here. Um, what I would like to see is that we we further this initiative out to uh, other beaches in the area, especially like our Victoria Bay area and our Harold's Bay area. Um, we will keep on uh, um, pursuing that we can get uh, blue flag status on that beaches as well in that area. Why haven't the other beaches received, haven't received blue flag status so far? What is the reason for that? Um, I know that there were stringent, uh, very stringent criteria for blue flag status, especially um, the, the water quality that needs to be tested. Um, the services authority would like to, uh, you to have uh, water tested regularly at least three times a day and I know that in some areas, especially here in wilderness, we had difficulty previously because of water coming down uh, um, the ravine here um, where we didn't have all the testing up to standard at, at certain stages when they do, did, did the testing previously. So that uh, is one of the, the criteria on this side. But um, we will pursue um, applying for blue flag status in our other beaches because I believe that we do have the necessary the standards is there um, that we will qualify in the near future for having blue flag status in uh, Harold's Bay as well as in uh, Victoria Bay.